And I go through the Wolfram Battery Tunnel and my back's starting to hurt really bad. I'm starting to sweat profusely. My leg is getting rubbed completely raw and I'm bleeding out of my socket. And then I see the light at the end of the tunnel, not my death, but it's coming out of the tunnel where I was gonna stop. So I'm gonna stop there. When I got out there, on the other side of that tunnel was 343 firefighters lined up with banners around their neck to represent 343 lives lost on 9-11. And I thought, boy, if they could finish that, uh, you know, if they could ultimately perish on 9-11, go up and down the flight of stairs, try to save lives, I can finish 1.2 miles. So I did, fortunately. I finished the race. Afterwards, I got up on stage. Lieutenant Dan Van, you guys know Forrest Gump, right? Gary Sinise. Um, Gary Sinise has a band called Lieutenant Dan Van. He plays a lot of bass. And, and he played a lot of bass. That's all he does is play the bass in the band. But great guy. They're putting a concert on. 20,000 people strong. If you guys ever text Gary Sinise, a lot of emojis. I just don't do that, so I, I always find it a little bit different. But he's a good friend of mine, so don't tell him I told you guys that. But uh, so the Ted Dan Band's playing. I get up on stage. A couple other guys are up there. The crowd, 20,000 deep going crazy. Yeah, you know? And then I'm walking out, and I'm sore. I mean, I'm tired, but it's, it's uh, kind of rejuvenating. And then there's a cord across the stage. I don't see. My toe catches it, and then gravity kicks in. So 20,000 people are like, yeah, and all of a sudden, <laughs> just, ooh. <laughs> what happened?